hello guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here you're absolutely welcome my name is anami and i'm a lagos based youtuber so in today's video i'm going to be doing a pedicure and a manicure at home this is how my foot looks you can see all the dead skin remember this is a no judgment zone so i'm going to start doing my pedicure the first thing you want to do is soak your feet in hot water but make sure the water is not too hot and i'm going to add apple cider vinegar i'm just going to shake it and add in it has anti bacteria and antifungal properties and i'm going to use some olive oil as well just to make the food soft i can use sea salt or epsom salt but i don't have these so that's why i'm using these ones so i'm going to soak my foot for about 15 to 20 minutes you want to make sure you soak your foot not less than 15 minutes so you to be able to get soft and remove all that dead skin So it's about 20 minutes now i'm going to use this double-sided foot file and i'm going to start filing my foot gently you can see all the dead skin coming up that's the result of soaking my feet for more than 15 minutes just to get that out so i'm done with that i'm going to use my cortical trimmer and i'm going to start trimming my cortical gently you have to do this very gently so you don't injure yourself as i said earlier you can use epsom salt or sea salt if um you don't have apple cider vinegar and if you don't have the salt you can also use apple cider vinegar and any essential oil you have will work as well so i'm going to use this diy sugar scrub and i'm going to scrub my feet I'm done scrubbing my feet. I'm just going to put my foot in the bowl of water for about five minutes and I'm going to use cold water to rinse it off. So now I'm just going to use my nail file to file my nails to the shape that I want them to go. So now I have this shea butter carrot oil made with shea butter i have that video i'm going to leave it in the description box below so i'm just going to use that to moisturize my feet you need something thick a thick moisturizer to moisturize your feet so i'm just going to give it a massage as i'm moisturizing so i'm just going to paint my nails with this nail polish This is how my feet is looking after everything it looks better it looks moisturized it looks cleaner <laughs> let me know in the comment section is there any difference <laughs> So now I'm going to do the same thing for my hand. I have apple cider vinegar and olive oil in there. I soaked it. Then I'm going to use my DIY sugar scrub to scrub my hand very well. Then I'm going to put my hand back in the water. Then I'm going to rinse it off. This is how my hand looks. So I'm going to use my cortical trimmer as well to gently, remember guys, gently remove the cortical from my nails. So I'm going to use this nail file also to file my nails.
so i'm done with that i'm going to use vaseline on my nails just to strengthen them and make them soft as well now i'm just going to paint my nails the same nail polish that i used for my feet i also used the carrot oil made with shea butter to moisturize my hand So I'm done painting my hands and this is how everything looks. I'm done with my pedicure and my manicure. This is just something you can do at home to help you relax and help your skin. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next one. Bye.